guys, this is Eric the Eric, welcome to 60 Seconds. Oh, crap, am I in for another torture chamber? Comic drill? I'm guessing that's tutorial. Apocalypse is, what's scavenge? Savage. Yeah. Screw it! We're diving into the apocalypse! Little boy fat man, Tosa Boom. Huh. There's the little things down here. Oh, you suck. Trouble every day? All right. Oh, no, shit. Oh crap, we'll do Fat Man. Begin the adventure! Oh, I'm so screwed diving into this. Yes, what a. Ah, what? Oh crap, it's already started! Here, Freddy! I don't know how to pick you up! I posted a mouse on the screen, aren't I? There we go. Ah! Get in there, Mona! Whoa! Did I just get everything out in the hallway? I gotta get the crap, I gotta get the crap. Oh, crap, oh, crap, oh, crap, 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 crap. Uh, Timmy! Wife! Get over here! Oh, God! So screwed! I gotta get myself to the shelter and keep this up. Ah, 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 ah! I'm screwed! I have no map! Oh, I could have gone for more. Oh, shite! Love you, world! I think I just died. <laughs> Everybody else is screwed. Wait, what the hell? Okay, so I did die. Crap! I didn't know you could click these. Oh, I have ammo. I have nothing. I have a locking. I'm so freaking screwed here. You perished. <laughs> okay, apparently if daddy's not down there, nobody can do anything themselves. <laughs> I had water, I had food. <laughs> but apparently without a dad, nobody's got brains enough to even make a head. Oh, I'll try that again. <laughs> That's kind of dumb. I mean, nobody can... Timmy can't do it himself, neither can the wife. God, what are we running off? The 1940 logics where nobody can do anything themselves? Here we go. This is a good sir. Room, what do you mean? Help. You mean no room? A freaking work case! My daughter's fat. And holy smokes, if I can't cure, if I have to carry just her, oh, take three hands for just her. I'm gonna be screwed the first few times. Ah! Yep, I'm not getting to the shelter in time. Life! In the safe zone! Into the shelter! We're screwed regardless! <laughs> oh, we are not surviving at all. This is not a good start. I have no radio, I have nothing. <laughs> oh, 
I am screwed, Family Guy. I have a map and nothing else. No one will ever know I'm down here. All of us made it into the shelter just a second before the blast. That was a close one. As long as we're all together, we can make it work down here. Yeah, that's what you freaking say. Remember, hearing canned soup is healthy for you. Yeah, I grabbed no water. We can't remember bringing those supplies down to the shelter, but we're not complaining. We probably have a st should have a stocked it better anyway. One checkerboard. Good thing we grabbed the suitcase that we found. Definitely prove useful. Plus one map. Our shelves are full of all, all full of cans. We'll eat from cans. We'll sleep on cans. We'll talk to cans. Some of us already do. That doesn't say we already got crazy mental issues. There's just barely enough water for everyone. We'll have to ration it strictly. Yeah, yeah. I, I thought I would do better or worse to me on this. Okay, we're doing good. We decided to have some fun today and play a game or two. The first one was picking the game we are going to play. This took most of the day and we still haven't made up our minds. Alright. Day two! How do I hear radiation sounds? We thought playing the silent game would be a good idea. The silence was too annoying and we quickly stopped. It was impressive how well Mary Jane is handling this situation. She looks fine today. Despite the dire circumstances and all the trouble we are going through, Timmy is being very brave. Today has been fine for Dolores thus far. That <laughs> Superman. I got you to Dad said there's no need to worry about him. He's okay. Yes, yes, we really freaking should prepare. We've been smelling something funny in the shelter ever since we sure enough there's something. Someone or someone started a fire. Already it's spreading. We can't save everything. What do we do? Save nothing because we don't have anything. God, I already started day one and I have a fire there, bro. Who starts a fire in the middle of a shelter? We rushed right into the flames to put it out as quickly as possible. We were able to stop it before it did any real damage. Phew, that was close. <laughs> Freaking hell! Water is what Mary Jane needs most right now. Timmy prefers apple juice, but right now he should get him some water. Dolores, water is all she wants. Ted is really thirsty. Or screwed. We have one water. What to take outside? We have nothing. Well said. Her outside the chick. Yeah, she's not going to come back. I'm just screwed. I mean, I don't blame her. I've got like nothing down here. I would run if I was her. <laughs> Mary Jane went outside. Let's hope she hurries back. She's kind of strong. No good news is good news. Nothing going on with Timmy. Everything seems okay with Dolores. No problem. What if we could scroll the crossbones on there? That doesn't make me feel safe. We are not alone. There's a huge hairy bunny beast that seems to be hiding one of the pipes. It's been poking its head out and eyeing her for me. Watch, I'm gonna break the axe. I made it to day five, and my axe isn't broken! Hot damn! Our cans are saved. Too bad for the hairy mutant. Guess we'll still top of the food chain. Good for us. Timmy seems okay. As much as he can be in the current situation, Timmy was relatively calm for Dolores. Oh, today was Timmy. He was calm for the Lord. There isn't much going on with Ted. No trouble, nothing new. It's easy to escalate silly arguments at close quarters don't help. We're chatting and then suddenly we were fighting and fighting and hope this gets... Apparently we're wanting to kill each other already? It's only been six days and nobody can get helpful? He whiz. Can I get some report on what happened to my daughter? We're done fighting, but for how long? Timmy doesn't need much, but he should drink. Doris has to drink sometimes, Ted should drink soon. Sorry guys. We might be safe at safe levels, but there are a few other problems that none of us can sleep properly. We have to deal with this as soon as possible, otherwise we might fall asleep as face real like saucers from Mars. Sorry guys, I don't have a health kit. We are screwed. We are not looking good. You guys need food. Rather than ignoring our symptoms, we try to at least go an hour or two of sleep. No, look. We're even more tired than we were. We have our problems. We need to face soon. Let's hope our yawning will be enough to scare raiders away or save us from radiation sickness. Timmy's in terrible shape. We need to get water now. Timmy is really tired. Dolores will not survive with a water water. He's been great. He needs to drink right now. Oh, boy. We're freaking screwed. We had most. We had the most curious visits. One of them was making the sounds of a glopping horse using a pair of rocks and hitting them against each other. <laughs> Freaking Mighty Python, Holy Grail reference. 
They claim to be a very important quest to seek a magical cup, only they lost their way to lace, and they asked to... Fine, I'll take a shot at it. I hope they don't kill us. Or take my map or break it. Hey, my map's still there! They seem to be really friendly, so we let them take a look at the thing. That doesn't offer some supplies in it. We really should accept it. Really? I've already got a lock! I don't need two locks! No news is good news. There's nothing going on. Dolores is quite calm. The morning has been calm. I guess everybody can eat. We're almost gonna die anyways. Like day eight. The group dodgers knocked the door. Today requesting some supplies that would be helpful in refilling their first aid kits. We don't doubt that they were real to for a deal for a second. So they did have lab coats and everything, so we agreed to help them. Too bad I don't have anything to help them. God, that guy looks horrible. What is this, scam? They're not real doctors. No way that crooks can mean nothing. Well, they weren't real doctors, apparently. And our daughter just ran out on us and left us to die. In hell. Thanks, daughter. Since we jumped out, so we've been undergoing the other door in the shelter. Should it even be there? Where does it lead? Try to check it out. Take the gun. Oh, I got the bullets. Okay. Cool. Holy crap, she's alive. We figured the best way to secure uh, no one jumps inside the mysterious room was to bash the door and start firing. When the smoke was clear, we were able to assess our room was empty. We hit nothing but walls and merely dodged a ricochet. Dude, oh boy, did you get away water? Checked every personal kernel, even if it didn't seem promising. With that, I ventured into the ruins of the local bank, hoping to find something more than useless pre apocalyptic coins. The bank was robbed just before the blast. The vault was crapped with open with saws, hidden in teddy bears. <laughs> teddy bears. We could see why they wanted to rob it so badly. The place was filled with tomato soup cans. How did it end up here? Maybe the mall, the mail had it delivered at a bank instead of food bank? I have water! Thank you! Photoshop had the floor next to the counters. It contained a couple of rotten bananas, a hand cream, a pair of bunny slippers. I want the bunny slippers! Some bottled water, tempting all of us as these treasures may have been. We limited ourselves to taking the water. So this is how they guarded the place? Unacceptable. In the guard room, we found skeletons of two individuals who seem to be have played cards when the bomb hits. Ow. We kept all our money in a real safe place. That is our special cookie jar in the kitchen. Those guards didn't provide much security here, but their cards will contribute to high quality entertainment. Yay, poker! <laughs> Mary Jane is quite hungry. Mary Jane contracted an illness. Oh, frick. Mary Jane is really tired. How about Timmy getting something to. Drink. He's not looking well. Dolores won't last long with the water. Wrong thing. Thank you for the water! Oh crap, we're almost out now. There's no condition we can send Dolores. I don't get a choice, you maniacs. You blew it up. Damn you. Blew it all to hell! That's something we should have told our neighbors when they blew up their barbecue last screen. Those were good times, even if they wasted a perfectly good... Oh, crap. <laughs> Living in the past is not wise in our current situation. You need to think of tomorrow. Mary Jane is starving. We better give her food or else. Looks like the good scout he is. Timmy is making the best of the situation. He even seems cheerful. Dolores is quite well. Pretty food. It's not like I don't got a ton of that. It's on Ted outside. He, he's really good at coming back. He's the man. Yeah, everybody else dies because we have no water. He's kind of hungry. Team seems to be okay. Life is hard for all of us right now, but Dolores is in a good mood today. We hope to stay with you. Ted left for the shelter. We'll see you back soon. I have water. I have one freaking water. We are dead. We are dead, man. If there's anyone who can rescue us from the hell It's our government. You believe in the government. Yeah, we must be in the old society. Well, that probably means you're either a naysayer or a kami. Bad mouth them. <laughs> we're good citizens. We've been paying our taxes regularly, so we're sure Uncle Sam is coming to get us. Well, except for that one time we, well, we never mind. <laughs> what? The government people are coming. We should keep our ears and eyes open for any sign of them. Okay.
Is there one thing left to do? Use our radio on a regular basis to catch any emergency broadcasts that might be transmitted. Too bad we didn't get it when we were trying to get our asses down here. <laughs> so we're screwed. The first option sounded a bit more sane. Mary Jane diet could use a little bit more food. Tim is rested. Dolores has to drink sometime. We're out of water. What point of this do you not get, people? I don't have anything. One minute it was fine, and the next we were at each other's throats. How this happen? This is insane. We're dead. I'm just gonna wake up and find somebody dead in the corner of a room. Unless Ted comes back. We're screwed. We stopped arguing about for how long. Mary Jane Diet could use a little food. God, how much can you eat? Yeah, I know. Well, I don't have any water. No yeah, chance the radio broke. We're dude, We're just dead. I'm gonna have like a bunch of skeletons down here. We can't survive more than two days without water. I mean, really? Man, yeah, that sucks. But seriously, take some this. Another day without a clue what's going on might kill us. Might not necessarily care. Mary Jane keeps playing. We really need to find our water. Timmy could eat water with nice. Yeah, well, I'm out of SOL. We never thought we'd live to see a dancing cockroach. We still haven't, but we saw one. That was nearly as big as a cat. Holy crap! That's a big cockroach. The good news is they probably scared off any rats in the area. Bad news is they are huge and will probably attack us when we get a chance. I'm gonna die to a cockroach. I died to a cockroach. And Timmy went cuckoo ka -choo. Oh my god, that thing is huge, and there goes another one. Roaches everywhere were doomed. We already feel all dirty. When Mary Jane found out she had got, got a single drink of water, she got furious. She stormed out the wasteland, shouting over her shoulders that she were, we will regret this. She's getting her water one way or another. We're seriously terrified right now. If only we had a few drops of water, we could have avoided this. Dolores died of dehydration last night. Ted has been outside far too long and still has not returned. We fear he isn't coming back, so then the apocalypse is going to task. We can tell you that much. We spent 16 days in the show. Freaking Ted! Damn you, Ted! You were supposed to be the man! Instead, you just said screwed everybody! Seriously, how's everybody going outside with no radiation suits after only 16 days? If atomic nuclear warfare happened, you can't come out after 16 days. You'd have, like, critical cancer minutes. And Ted left us. The husband of the house left his family to die. The one I thought was responsible. I sent out. God. All right, guys. Well, let, hit the comments below and let me know uh, what the heck I can do to make this work better. God, this was messed up. See you guys on the next one. Bye-bye.